many of the villages were invaded, so the people escaped and they became refugees. Even with the war spreading everywhere, missionaries were there, but missionaries were limited in the Vientiane, uh, the capital city. 1975, uh, the Americans decided to withdraw from Vietnam, Cambodia, and they did the same thing from Laos. All the Hmong throughout the country knew that they would be left behind to be killed or tortured by the new communist government. So they began to escape. They escaped by foot, crossing the Mekong rivers to Thailand. It was crowded, all kind of health problems. People died almost every day, every night. In the midst of those uh, sufferings and poverty and uncertainty about tomorrow, they accepted Christ in a great number in the camp. CMA missionaries were in the camps helping and uh, taking care of and being consultant for us. So we consider ourselves members of the Christian Missionary Alliance. When the immigration began, resettlement of the Hmong people into the United States, CMA churches were smaller churches and they could not sponsor refugees. Very few did. And this year, 2003, we celebrated our 25th anniversary in America as Hmong District. So we have grown in these 25 years from 1,500 to uh, 29,000 members. Even though we are under leadership of the CMA, we consider ourselves as indigenous churches that we could lead our own churches. 50 years ago, the Hmong were living in uh, Siang Kuang province in Laos, and we were missionary fields. And the CMA sent missionaries to us. And now 50 years later, the Hmong sent our own missionaries out to other people. The Hmong have made a full circle from being a missionary field to missionaries. And what I really appreciate the uh, CMA we are a movement to send our missionaries to the unreached people. And uh, without that uh, vision and passion of our founder, Dr. A.B. Simpson, I believe that the Hmong would not have heard the gospel. I am here, I know other denominations, big denominations, but they didn't send missionaries to Laos. It was a tiny, small denomination like the CMA that sent missionaries to us. And because of those missionaries, the Hmong accepted Christ and the Hmong had been blessed by God.